Oh, my head hurts today. Oh, I'm sorry, buddy. It's broken Jeffrey in the morning. Was it a migraine? Well, I don't know. I don't know if it hurts because I had one too many Sea Breeze cocktails last night. Sea Breeze, bro. What are you? <laughs> Who are you? Isn't that grapefruit juice? Is that why you're rock? Is that why you're rocking out to the Grease soundtrack? Yeah, I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> or could it be that my playlist of jackhammering noises that I used to fall asleep uh. isn't as soothing as I had hoped? What? I may go with a combination of the two. Yeah. All I know is my brain is hurting, and hopefully oh, I'll get some relief after I pop a couple Tylenol, and empty out my thoughts in another edition of What's On Your Mind, where we go around the room and find out what each member of the morning show has been thinking about lately. So let's share our thoughts and feelings, starting with Brooke. Brooke, oh. what's on your mind? My gosh, I have been so excited to tell you guys about this. Uh, oh, oh I my. am. I'm so excited. Oh, it's I not found... helping my headache. God, Dude, God. <laughs> this is life-changing. Okay. All right. Coffee naps. Some oh. people call them a nappuccino. Do you guys know about these? Haven't heard about they them. They are going to change your world. Okay, okay. I tried it. I tried it a couple days ago, and it works. Okay, there's some science about, like, I don't know, sleep chemicals and your brain and mm. what caffeine does to it. But what you need to do is, before you take a nap, you drink a cup of coffee. Okay? Sounds well, counterintuitive, yeah. right? Does, yeah. uh-huh. And then in the 15-minute window after you drink the cup of coffee, you have to fall asleep. Okay. What? Then you sleep for 20 to 30 minutes. Okay. And you wake up more refreshed and energetic than ever before. Whoa. There's no grogginess. You're ready to roll. They say scientists say that this is better than just even sleeping. So wait, oh is it God. because like the coffee hits you as you're waking up too? Is it your power nap? Well, it's it's happening while coffee? you're asleep. Yeah, it's happening oh, while you're asleep. The caffeine's working, and yeah. then it's like taking down those chemicals that are telling your brain that you're sleepy. Dude, it's amazing. I feel like coffee wow. naps. I feel like it's like a thing that works nice for the short term, no. but then like you come down like four hours later with like See? horrible exhaustion. Good point. I crashed pretty hard. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> But, but I would have been crashed all for the entire four hours instead oh. of just That's four true. hours later. It was amazing, you guys. I'm all about coffee naps. Okay. What if, what if you take too long of one? What no, if I fall asleep you got to, this timing is essential. So 30 minutes. Oh. If you don't Let fall me. asleep in that first 15 minute window, the whole thing is ruined. Oh. Oh. So, then, so you're supposed wow. to get so up and be productive after this. Yes. Oh. I've heard the same thing works though with meth though. Yeah. Meth naps. <laughs> you wake up with six times I, more energy than a coffee nap. I don't think yeah. you ever nap when you you do math. Oh, okay. I think that that is <laughs> the difference there. Yeah, no. <laughs> Nappuccino. I'm saying try it. All right. Try out the Nappuccino. You're me on it. Yeah, <laughs> seriously. It's so good. Jose, what's been on your mind lately? <laughs> I got scammed and I got scammed bad and I'm here to warn everybody listening what scammed me and why. So lately I've been working on my health a little bit, trying to go outside for five minutes here and there. And I saw a random ad on my Facebook about a peck sculptor. A what? Peck. It's like called your a pecs? Pec. Like, oh. like a male. man's pecs. Your pecs. Yeah. Okay. Push-ups. You work on your pecs. Okay. And this video is like 30 seconds. And it's like, all you need to do is three or four reps. And it's huge bodybuilders are like, oh, they can't touch the bottom of it. And it's just it sounds like, quick... like a th- the way you're moving your arms, it looks like it's a thigh master for your arms. Yes, uh-huh. it is. Exactly. It's like your forearms. You try to push them together. And like, it's Okay. Okay. So I see this and I'm like, dude, I'm gonna get ripped. I'm gonna spend this oh, hundred dollars no. on this. Wait, thing. you're hundred? you're a person who can't even take yourself for a walk. But mm-hmm. that's why the spec sculptor broke. You can sit uh. and watch TV and sculpt while you're doing. Like, you so can did take you, it anywhere. Did you get it? Did so it I pay for it. Okay. I pay for hundred bucks after shipping and handling. And I get dollars? it. It is literally a spring with two <laughs> pads on it. Yeah. And that's it. So I'm like, wait a minute, this is a giant spring. Then I read the instructions. And it's not, no, just do five like I thought. It's like, for best results, do a thousand. I'm like, what? Yeah, you actually have to work out. You have to, and it's easy. Like, there's no resistance. Just over and over and over and over. Now I'm over here, like, flapping wings in my living room. (laughs) Not feeling any burn. Nothing is being sculpted. And I realize after, like, 20 minutes, I'm like, I could, like, Wave my arms in the air, flail them randomly, and be doing more work than this stupid. So you realize that they took you because it's not that easy (laughs) to get. No. Really nice yeah. pecs. Boobs. You see these boobs? You yeah. they look sculpted? No, they don't. You yeah. see, I'm lifting up my shirt right now. Yeah. Really tiny yeah. nipples, so I think they got bigger. Look at those little nipples. I got tiny nipples and they lots are. of hair. Yeah. I need a hair sculptor <laughs> next. Tiny little nipples. Anyway, right, so, so if anyone listening, 
Hex sculptor doesn't work. Don't buy them offline. <laughs> I, I and they don't do refunds. I already <laughs> asked that because it's not broken. It's just a stupid machine. I would love to see you do like a video blog of you reviewing different workout Fitness. products. Yes. Oh god, that would be the best. That would be the best video blog that. ever. Like Dude. you just give up after five seconds on every piece of machine. <laughs> And next you should try that that machine that like just shakes while you sit on it. Have you seen that one? No. Yeah, those are from like the 50s. Yeah, right? they came out with the new version. You should try that Dude, one. Dude, it's better than me not moving. Yeah. Okay, well, if you have any suggestions for me to sculpt, then text in. All right. Right. Try something else. Yeah, but don't don't text in that he should go to the gym. That's yeah. off the table. No, yeah. Yeah, that's like real weights. I'm looking to sculpt quickly. <laughs> Social media coordinator Alexis, tell us what's been on your mind. Yeah, so this morning I had a meltdown about work. Uh -huh. Actually, About uh -huh. this job? Yes. Okay. About coming here today. What okay. happened? My four shirts that aren't crop tops were dirty. Oh. And, yes. Those are the only it's, ones that you oh wear. God, exactly. <laughs> so I had a meltdown that my whole closet is crop tops. And it is freezing in here from the AC. Yeah, I'm I like so how tired. That's, that's why you don't want to wear the crop tops. It's not because it's not a very professional look. No. <laughs> no not that. It's, that. it's been freezing in here lately. Yeah. And I'm so tired of my stomach being cold. Yeah. It's all just the, the belly. Time. You just need to tie a sweater around your waist. <laughs> yeah. She has a what? sweater on right now, but it's a halter top it is a, sweater. That's a crop top. <laughs> Crop very crop. And very crop I realized it's very cute. Then I was looking, I was like, well, I have to wear pants now. All holes uh, everywhere. Yeah. So, <laughs> except I did buy a pair of jeans this weekend with only two large holes. Ooh. Yeah. Oh. I like condensed. That's Aren't the like holes kind of going out? I feel like they're becoming the true religions um, of this no, uh, fashion in line. Style. I'm just saying. Yep, but I, I'd watch okay. that. <laughs> so but, what are you wearing now? Well, I'm in a crop top, but I'm just, yeah, I'm it's trying a, to feel It's like, an old one that's unwashed? No, 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 no. This is clean. I just, all my That's all she had. Oh. I have four yeah. shirts I wear to work, and I'm just starting to feel like this isn't professional anymore. You know, mm. it's kind of hitting me. Holy jeans and a crop top yeah. are really <laughs> yeah, wear to work. So I just, I want to know where to go buy clothes that do cover my belly button. Not sure where to go. <laughs> Anywhere. <So. laughs> Brooke will give you some recommendations. Yeah. She has shirts yeah. to go down to her knees. No, you don't, you don't need shirts. You just need really big underwear. Yeah. That's what oh, I go with. No, yeah. I do need some tips on dressing old. <laughs> <laughs> oh god no, <laughs> no. okay <laughs> all right. so gross. thought it was a solution yeah. <laughs> jeffrey what's on your mind well i it, it's been really difficult for me to enjoy my outdoor time lately why because you know it's sunny out which is nice so i'll okay. go outside and try and relax in my backyard and whenever i'm out there all I ever hear is, <clears throat> and this has been going on for weeks. That sounds exciting and to me. Yeah, who's mating in your backyard? Well, it's not that. And I'm wondering, you know, what is this grunting noise? Yeah. Like, uh, uh, uh. and I realized it's because my street has been a really popular path for cyclists. <laughs> And it's on a hill. Uh, and so all the cyclists oh. are grunting going up the hill right past my house. So it's become super hard to enjoy like a beautiful summer day. And yeah, you might think I would like hearing yeah, that I sound. Yeah, I like people in spandex grunting in your front yard. I thought that this was no. kind of why you probably are renting the place. No, they're not stopping. That's the point. Oh. That's the problem. And it just comes out of nowhere. There's like the sounds of birds chirping. I'm watching dragonflies going back and forth. And then... Uh, 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 <laughs> it is unnerving. That's hilarious. Do you, you just move to like a wooden area? Do you just right? want to yell like, "Get off and walk your bike up the hill. It'll be quicker." <laughs> totally. Or I think I might actually put signs up outside of my house like, "No grunting within 50 yards." Wow. Oh no. I'll have yeah. like a stop grunting no, zone. No, you don't want to mess with bicyclists. Zone. They'll come no, for your right? throat. Yeah, dude. they're so aggressive. Yeah. They'll call the city. They'll be like a, no. a route through your living room. Whatever. Then. They're gonna leave <laughs> flaming dog poop on your doorstep. Yeah. Or something like that. Well, as long as they're not grunting while they do it. Yeah. So I can enjoy my outdoor time. Anyway. You've really grown as a person. I really have. Yeah. <laughs> Text into 78592. Tell us what you've been thinking about lately, positive or negative. You can get it off your chest.